welcome to Architects Tour and this is the Star Vista. Star Vista was designed by Andrew Gromberg, an architect in ADAS architectural firm. ADAS architectural firm has branches in China, Hong Kong, Singapore, India, UAE, London, and the United States. The Star Vista is located in the central region of Singapore. The Star Vista is very near Buena Vista MRT, Glaxo Smithline Asia office, Rochester Mall, composed of hotels, condominiums, and some commercial restaurants, Metropolis offices, Ministry of Education Singapore headquarters, One North offices, One North Park, and almost all the sides of the Star Vista is composed of residential buildings which has above 1,000 population which is a very good factor for commercial buildings. The Star Vista has a site area of 90,200 square meters. The construction cost for the Star Vista was around 700 million Singaporean dollars or equals to 25 billion Philippine pesos compared to Mall of Asia which cost around 7 billion pesos. Imagine 7 billion pesos compared to 25 billion pesos. Around 3 Mall of Asia's can be built with this price tag of the Star of Vista. In 2019, a mega church in Singapore bought the Star of Vista Mall for around 296 million Singaporean dollars. This building has a total height of around 75 meters, which is equals to a 25-story residential in the Philippines. The Star Vista has 11 levels. The Basement 2, Basement 3, and Basement 4 consists of parking areas, while the Basement 1, Level 1, and Level 2 is composed of commercial shops and restaurants. And from the Level 4 up to the roof, is composed of the 5,000 seat auditorium. This building has a gross floor area of 25,000 square meters for its retail and 8,000 square meters for the civic or public areas. When we compare it to Mall of Asia in Philippines, which has a gross floor area of 432,891 square meters and also compared to Trinoma Mall with a gross floor area of 224,502 square meters. The Star Vista was designed to have a contemporary design, just like the buildings that you are seeing now. From the third level up to the fifth level, the exterior of Star Vista is covered with fiberglass cladding, and the upper portion is covered with aluminum composite panels. This huge portion of glass here is composed of high-performance triple-sheet glass with mylar interlayer. And we can see here the terraced landscaping that they used in the building. This portion is the area going to basement 1. While this part is the VIP entrance. And now we will be going to level 2 by using the escalator. And as we go up from level 1 going to level 2, we can see a 12mm thick tempered glass railing acting as a safety barrier between the outdoor deck of level 2 and the escalator. We are here now in level 2 and we can see this glass canopy on steel structure that is used as a protection from rain and sunlight for the consumers.
here we can see another glass canopy in steel structure used as a cover for the walkway of the outdoor deck. At the level 2 deck, we can see this outdoor seating And we also have this outdoor landscaping composed of trees and shrubs and some planters. Here is another design element, a slanted glass wall. And now here we are in level 2, we are looking at this alfresco dining or outdoor dining. And we can see this cove ceiling fan that is a design feature of this alfresco dining. Cove ceiling means a recessed ceiling. And now we will enter this level 2 lift lobby. We can see mahogany wood panels as a design for the wall of this lift lobby. And we also have this stainless steel skirting to protect the walls of the lobby. And now we will enter the building by using this automatic sliding glass door. Automatic glass sliding doors are much more expensive than manual swing doors, but they are more hygienic and better design feature. Now we are here in level 2, we can see these escalators going up to level 3. And since it is Christmas time now, they put up a 20 meter high Christmas tree at the grand foyer of the Star Vista. 20 meters high means it's the same height as a 6 story commercial building. We can also see this level 3 to level 4 outdoor escalator. A 400 seater outdoor amphitheater at level 3. And we have this escalator going down to level 1, having a glass canopy used as a cover for rain and sunlight. We also have this glass railing on stainless steel baluster acts as a safety barrier between the level 2 and the lower floors. We can see this grand ceiling from basement 1 up to level 4. The ceiling is covered with aluminum composite panels. Looking down from level 2 to basement 1, we can see this outdoor amphitheater. They have this yellow paint as a safe distancing marker during this pandemic season. And this open air here is what they call the grand foyer. Showing the basement 1. And the level 1 and this is the level 2 wherein we are currently standing and level 3 and we can see this 33 meter high column from basement 1 going to level 4 And another design feature of this building are these slanted columns from basement 1 up to level 4. And we can see these glass skylights showing a portion of the auditorium lobby at level 4. And now, I will be showing you a video of the 5,000-seat auditorium at level 4.